Hello, I'm here today and I just want to try to help you um, with your issues. We all have issues that we go through all the time. It's a daily battle that we must um, put our flesh under subjection daily. And I just want to do this um, upload for you. I'm coming to you in a soft meat voice because I want to, you want to, you want to try to receive the Holy Ghost. And, you know, it's not a problem because God said that He sent, He sent His Holy Spirit, Spirit to dwell on us, within us, okay? And you will know when you have it because some people, it's not as dramatic as others. You know, some people, they just get to cry and shed tears on their eyes. That's a form of the Holy Ghost, the Holy Spirit that's upon you. You have it to where as you feel chill bumps on your arms, you get the little goosebumps or what we call Jesus bumps. Okay, so you get that. You have it to where as you might just go and you just start rocking and because you're fully meditating Him. But see, you have to, what you do is, and I'm going to help you. And I, 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 I actually, I sent that. I, I made a song. And I was feeling it at the moment, and it's not a song you're going to hear on the radio, it's just God put it in my spirit, and I put it, oh, I'm getting chill bumps right now, so uh, I just want to go in, and I want to pray for a moment, and uh, as I go in and pray, we're going to usher in the Holy, the Holy Ghost, um, we're going to do this together, so what I want you to do is go in a quiet place, if you're in a quiet place, and just close your eyes, don't have a, don't have a TV running, don't have any music running, anything like that. It's just um, between you and God, okay? And um, you can ask God for the gift of tongue. It's a gift of tongue. Um, if you want the gift to interpret the tongue, you can. But I'm going to tell you, whenever you're praying and your spiritual man take over and you speak it in tongues, um, you're not going to know what you're saying. But if you're in a congregation, in church or whatever, and you're speaking a tongue, um, that's different. Go to my video about speaking a tongue, not for the foolish, because I give that um, opening or um, to whereas when you're in a, a, a congregation, if you're speaking a tongue, it's supposed to be a interpreter there, because that's basically the Holy Spirit coming through talking. Okay, so again, let me go in and I want to I wanna pray with you. And I just want to say, um, I'm more than happy. Just reach out to me anytime. And if you need to go in further, that's not a problem. I'm always here to help those who want help, sincerely want help. And, and that's what God put me on the path to do. So I, I want to do this um, with you and for you. And we can do this together. So I'm just taking a deep breath right now. And I just want to go in and I want to just, I just want to go in and I'm, I'm going to thank him for waking me up this morning and sending me on my way. I want to thank him for my family, the ones that give me problems, the ones that don't. I just thank him for it and I pray for the ones that, that God healed them. Father God, I come to you in the mighty name of Father God. Father God, you know what they need. You know they want or that they die. God, if they call upon your name, Father God, and they say, Jesus, I need you. Jesus, forgive me of my sins, Father God, known and unknown. Father God, in the mighty name of Jesus. Jesus, come into my heart. I want to be set free. I want to feel your presence all over me. I want to feel it from the crown of my head to the soles of my feet. Father God, as I go deep and deeper, I seek your faith. I seek your knowledge, Father God. I seek your love. The world can't give me the love. Lord, I want to... I want to be delivered from, just, just tell them what you want to be delivered from. Lord, so deliver those who have the addiction to smoking, um, cigarettes, to have the addiction, the addiction to smoking, um, weed, Lord, to drinking alcohol, Lord, 
the witchcraft, Father God, um, hex and booty, Lord, deliver me, Father God. Anything that was passed over them, Father God, in the mighty name of Jesus, we Lord, we bound them in the mighty name of Jesus, because we're bound in heaven, shall be bound down on earth. We bound them, Lord, and we send them back to the pits of hell, Father God. Father God, now as I stretch out my hand unto you, Father, unto you, Father, I stretch out my hand. Lord, let your spirit pour out on those who seek you, Father God. Father God, I come in the mighty name of Jesus, Father God. I thank you for your many blessings, Father God. I thank you for another day to call upon your mighty name. Lord, I want to be a vessel for you, Father God. So I can spread the news, the, the word of the good news, Father God, to someone else that don't know you, Lord. Lord, come into my life, Father God. Come into their lives, Father God. Help them, Father God, in the mighty name of Jesus. Save them for the world of despair, Lord. Take the world of the cares and cast their burdens upon you, Father God, so their soul can be lifted in the mighty name of Jesus, Father God. Come for them, Father God, in the mighty name of Jesus. In the mighty name of Jesus. In the mighty name of Jesus. I call upon your name, Jesus. I plead the blood of Jesus. I plead the blood of Jesus. I plead the blood of Jesus on the Father God. I plead the blood of Jesus. Holy Shikareko Roshe Yabaya. In the mighty name of Jesus, help them, Father God. Help them, Father God. Come to them, Lord. Send your mighty angels of protection and, and love and comfort to surround them, Lord. Put a blanket of comfort and love over them, Father God, so they feel your presence. No demonic presence, Lord. Just your presence in the mighty name of Jesus. And say, go and they research the things, Lord, so they can show themselves approved, Father God, if they study your word, Father God, and they won't be deceived by the word of things, Lord, that they discern and be sensitive in the spirit so they can discern who's for them and who's not. They can discern what's of the world and what's wicked, Lord, and what's not. They can discern when someone comes in sheep clothing, Father God, who's real and who's not. Father God, cast your spirit and your Holy Ghost them, and I ask it in the mighty, mighty name of Jesus. In Jesus' name I pray. In Jesus' name I pray. Amen. I hope this was a blessing to you. If you felt tears at your time, and I want you to continue to pray. Don't stop because I stop. I want you to continue to pray, and I want you to continue to lift up your name. And I want you to just sit there and in, in your chair, you just start calling up on the name of Jesus. If you got to say it a hundred times, ten thousand times, call on the name of Jesus. Call on the blood, baby. God say, oh, the blood of Jesus. Oh, the blood of Jesus. I've been washed clean. Oh, the blood of Jesus. You feel goosebumps coming on you. You got the Holy Spirit. You feel tears coming down your eyes. You don't count the Holy Spirit. You just feel like you're rocking and you just feel like just something is a hold of you. You got the Holy Spirit, baby. You do. Okay? So I just want you to be encouraged. And remember, reach out to me anytime. I'm here. Um, you can befriend me if you want. If you want some personal messages or whatever, something more private where it won't be out on an open comment, that is fine with me. If you need to reach me, um, um, I can't say face to face unless you live in the Houston area. Um, that's fine. If you need to reach out to me with a call, email, um, however, that's fine. I'm more than welcome to be your spiritual sister in Christ. I love you. There's nothing you can do about it. Go in Christ and Christ goes to you. And be with Christ in everything you do. Be blessed.